If you're a big swim team and you like to order a lot of gear, maybe you ought to check out Swim Outlet Team Division for these reasons. Swim teams receive a 10% discount on bulk orders. Swim teams or organizations get an 8% commission on referred sales. You'll also like their customization services, which is affordable and available at all times during the year for all team gear. With over 50,000 items in stock, you can get most anything you want. Swim Outlet Team Division. You need to try it out. You'll be glad you did. No, I'm not really focused. No, I'm definitely not. No. And Eddie, <laughs> I'm, Eddie's still trying to get me over to the other side towards the distance lane and doing that 400. Uh, yeah. I know. <laughs> Don't put that in there. <laughs> 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 Three-time Olympic medalist Ricky Barron said we could use that clip for the record. Ricky, despite representing Team USA in London on the 4x100 freestyle relay and splitting a 48.52 and being 25, a little bit old, he's not scaling back mid-distance training. You know, I, I don't want to take anything away from my 200, and that's that's a big thing, and that's uh, speed is great for the 100. I, that's probably why I, well, Endurance is great for the hunter. That's kind of why I try to like negative split it. Yep. But uh, I'd love to have that little extra speed. But you know that could take away from my 200. And in the end, the 200 is is my my event. And the 100 is great, but the 200 is where where I'm at. Team USA has been dominant in the 4x200 freestyle relay, winning every gold medal at the Olympic Games since 2004. What's it going to take to make the 200 free at the World Championship Trials? Top six. Yeah. Hopefully as fast as it did uh, last summer. I think that'd be great, if not faster. Uh, you know, I'm really, really impressed with uh, Dwyer's 49.2 in that brief. I'm, uh, that's uh, great for him. So I know he's going to be up there, and I, I would think, I think we could see a couple guys under 46 after the Aussie trials, after the French trials. I think we're, we all have our eyes. We all, we all saw that, and we we got to make sure to be down there. What about the 4 by 100 freestyle relay? You know, I think our trials was pretty slow last year in that, and I, I think. Uh, that was just kind of, it was a weird heat for us to all go that, that uh, slow and I think, I think we'll be a lot faster this year, 40, 48 lows, yeah 48 lows, then Nathan's just going to be, he's going to drop something dirty. The men's 4x100 freestyle relay has always been hotly debated and Australia's James Magnuson just ripped a 47.53 at their nationals in April. Was Ricky paying attention? I watched it, yeah. Uh, those guys, they're just so strong. They get through the water so fast, so strong. Uh, I love the way he swims it. You know, he gets out fast and he gets home faster than anybody. Um, and he said he could go faster, which who knows? Vlad went the 47.9 after incident delays. Now that's, you pay attention. Yeah, uh, and that is very, very hard to do after that NCAA's. So that's very impressive. I was hoping he'd be a little faster. I was, I was thinking after his, after his. After his NCAA performance, I thought he was going to be a little quicker, uh, but you know that, that meet takes a lot out of you. So uh, we're looking. I'm looking forward to see what, see what that that little guy does. <laughs> like most of Team USA swimmers, Ricky Barons couldn't escape questions about Michael Phelps and his absence from the World Championship team. In his answer, it was probably better than anybody's. You know, Ryan's around. Uh, we have a lot of guys my age who, who are ready to step up, but <laughs> it's funny. The young guys right now are so fast. Mm -hmm. It's. The times that they're putting up right now, when I was their age, like I, I wouldn't have been one of the top recruits in the country for the for the seniors in high school going out there right now. And there is a, there is a, a tier of guys that are just, I mean, they're tearing it up right now. And uh, it's very, very good for, for USA Swimming. And the breaststroke, I mean, we had, um, what's, what's his name? I don't know which one. Fresh stroke. Uh, Kevin Cordes. Kevin Cordes. Cordes. I mean, I mean, he's incredible. Uh, you know, Tom Shields and Butterfly and uh, Freestyle. I mean, we're, we have guys coming and coming. And we might in some events be here and there, but uh, by the next Olympics, we're going to be right back to where we were. Just appearances, friends' weddings, uh, swimming here and there, and uh, a couple appearances here and there. Uh, did you go to the Creepers' wedding? I did not. I had the bachelor party. Are I had the bachelor party. Actually, I, I was here. One of, my, one of my best friends from uh, back at home was getting married the same weekend. So I got to come back here and, and hang out and celebrate that.